Hi folks. War week. Day four. It's over. For this guy. I'm done. No more working in the war for me. But, uh, I am a little exhausted at the moment. Uh, ready for some bed. Yeah. It's, uh, I've already stripped out of half my gear. Thought it's on the helmet for good measure. So, here it is. I'm hanging. All right, so figured. Uh, let's see what is, what I promised at the beginning of the week that we haven't covered yet. Um, yes, to top off the MRE series, here is the little condiment package that comes inside the MREs. Right now, since I'm so wiped and tired, I think I'm going to show you guys how combat coffee works. It's a little potent, but. It'll do the trick. Put a little hair on your chest. It'll definitely do that. Let's see if we got some non dairy creamer. A little bit of taster's choice. Yes, taster's choice. Uh, they used to have Folgers, the, the little ones, but a lot of those were really, really moldy. So, uh, you know, something just went terribly wrong at the, at the company, so they stopped doing that. Uh, we've got the Domino Sugar, 4 grams. Yeah, buddy. Um, also, they throw in the salt. Not going to be needing that for combat coffee. Uh, you got a book of matches. Light yourself a little campfire. Stay safe. Alright. Um, some chewing gum for later. You know, a little after dinner mint. Fantastic. Can't go wrong there. And let's not forget our little buddy, Tabasco. Focus. <laughs> That's cool. Okay, a little bit of sauce. Helps choke down some of the uh, some of the nails. And this is fantastic little bundle of toilet paper. Now, you know, for any of those of us who have ever been out in the field, you know, there's not a lot of toilet paper uh, out and about. So these little treasures, hang on to them, make them last. Take your single ply, fold that little sucker in quarters here. Let me tear off this little hand right there. Right, you're gonna hang on to that. I don't want to lose that. You're, you're needing that a little bit. All right. You do your business and you wipe it just like this. All right. Scoop it out. All right. And then you shuck it off. And then you grab your little bit. Yep. Thanks for the fingernail. There you go. All right, that's how we use combat toilet paper to make it last. Uh, all right, back to the coffee, the important stuff. All right, we're gonna take a little bit of a non-dairy creamer here. Shake it down. Open that sucker up. Get the old uh, taster's choice. This is my choice for good taste. All right, taster's choice. Combat coffee applied. Ta -da. All right. Take a little bit of this sugar here, right there. We're gonna sweeten that up just, just a touch. We don't want all that sugar in our coffee. All right, and uh, we're ready to rock. Shake that up. Oh yeah, that looks that looks great. It's hot. It's fresh. Mm, can't beat it. Mmm. <laughs> That'll go straight to my head. In about five minutes here, I'm good to go. Whole cup, right there. All right. What else? What else we got uh, for you this week? Oh, let's just go ahead and wrap it up with the uh, the overused catchphrase of the day. Well, it's pretty much been the overused catchphrase of this week. There's a war out there. 
it just doesn't need to be said anymore. I'm going to do my best to make an effort to discontinue the use of that catchphrase over and over again for the rest of my life. It's done. I'm, I'm done. I'm walking away. I'll try. Probably not. I'll probably say it a lot next time, too. Anyhow, until next time, I'm out of here. I'm going to take a shower and go to bed. See you guys. That's it. War Week's officially over. Goodbye, War Week. Until next time. We're losing all this. <laughs>